A project decades in the making has been completed in Grand Marais. This afternoon, construction workers finished putting the last pieces of rock into the community's breakwater. TV6's Eric Kane has more on what it means for this community. Grand Marais reached a 1,200-foot milestone today. After nearly four months of construction, crews are right now bringing in the last barge of rock to be used to complete the breakwater. The small waterfront community has had a breakwater on their wish list for nearly five decades. The goal of the structure is to protect the harbor from the rough Lake Superior waters, and perhaps no one is more struck by its completion than Jack Hubbard. I'm just so elated to have this project done. You have no idea how beautiful this pile of rock out here looks to me and to the community. Uh, uh, we once again are going to have a safe harbor. I just, uh, I'm very proud of what we were able to do here. As Burt Township supervisor, Hubbard has spent the past five years leading the fight to obtain funding for the project. The township and the state shelled out over $5 million on their breakwater, and Hubbard says securing the money would not have been possible without help. I will never be able to thank this community enough for the way they stood behind me in this fight. I think no one really believed it was going to happen, you know, until it actually started happening. So I think everybody's believing it now, and hopefully it'll get finished, the rest of it out here. As the community's project wraps up, work has just begun on a separate breakwater commissioned by the Army Corps of Engineers. The federal government has allocated over a million and a half dollars for the Corps to reconstruct 300 feet of its existing breakwater. According to the Corps, their project will wrap up by mid-November. Eric Kane, TV6 News, Grand Marais.